Okay guys, so we're working on a Becerra Evolve 42C combi boiler today. Uh, the problem or the fault that I was called out for is uh, a fault called E094. Something to do with combustion uh, is picking up high CO uh, and it's taking the boiler to the fault mode uh, several times a day and customers having to reset it. Uh, so I'm just here to check it. It's about five years old boiler. It was installed by somebody else, another engineer. Uh, found a few additional problems with it beside the CO problem, which is condensate not terminated correctly. Um, it was actually terminated through that hole, the same 21 mil pipe, and then somebody broke it from our side. So customer decided to just put a bucket under it for the time being. But we just need to get the combustion readings. So the interface on these is slightly different and if you've not regularly worked on it, you may find uh, that you need to do a bit of research before you start playing with it. So the very first thing we want to do is, so up and down keys, okay, and back, that will take you back to home screen, which is this screen here. We want to go to state. In state, once you've okayed that, it should give you boiler and main zone. If you have a, a Vaquera control controller connected to it, or programmer connected to it, you may only find main zone if it's connected, if the controller is connected to open therm. If it's showing you main zone, what you need to do is you need to disconnect the controller from this position. Once you've disconnected the controller and reset the boiler, by reset I mean uh, power cycled the boiler, turned it off from fuse spur, and then turned it back on. Uh, when you go to state, then you should see boiler and main zone. So we need to go to boiler, okay. Uh, it's a combi boiler set as combi, so heating and hot water, we need to turn it off. So now the boiler shouldn't accept any demand and it confirms that the boiler is in off state on here as well. So it shouldn't accept any external demand from any controller or hot tap, customer running hot tap. Our objective is to go to combustion analysis and get the high and low readings. So we go to menu, okay. It's only giving us the setting menu, which is kind of user settings, date and time, etc. We need to get to technical. So whilst on your on settings within menu, on settings screen, you want to press and hold back and down button together. So let's press and hold back and down together. Now it's asking for a password. So this is an engineer's password. Uh, this video is not for customers uh, or users. This video is for uh, registered engineers only uh, and competent people. So, okay, that. Now you can see settings as well as technical. So we go to technical. We okay that. Uh, it's got quite a few different submenus in technical, but the one we need is combustion analysis. So we okay that, we activate this function. We want the boiler to go on maximum speed. So that's the maximum rate and then minimum speed is minimum rate. So maximum speed, confirm. And the boiler will fire up on maximum speed. And let me just remove the probe out for the first couple of minutes. So it's not gonna flood our analyzer. Let's just go back to home screen so we can see what the boiler's doing as well. We will allow the boiler to run for a couple of minutes just to stabilize. The system's been on uh, for a while now. I think it's been working all morning. So the water temperature is fairly hot in the system anyway.